Hey guys, welcome back to the channel Learn with Art. Now, the next topic is we will compare the finite automatas with the Turing machine. As we have already known the structure of finite automata, in case of FAs, we have input tape on which the input alphabets are written and for reading that input alphabets we have header so here header read single cell at a time and move to write by one cell okay so here header always move from left to right only and from top to bottom so in case of FAs header can move in only one direction that is from left to right only so header can move in one direction that is left to right and in case of FAs, we cannot replace or override the content present on input tape. Okay, so that is possible in case of Turing machine. So let's compare the finite automata with Turing machine. So in case of Turing machine, we have input tape on which the input symbols are written and that are read by input header so header read single symbol at a time from input tape then we can replace the content of the tape and header will move to write by one say okay so while reading single symbol from input tape in case of turing machine we have to perform three steps that is first read current input symbol second step is we have to replace the current symbol by same symbol or you can replace it with some of the other symbol and then third step is move to write by one c okay now here means what the contents of input tape can also be changed and here the header can move from left to right as well as right to left move of header is also possible but the first move is always from left to right and then top to so that are some of the differences between Turing machine and finite automata if you read if you like my videos then please subscribe to my channel if you have any queries then please comment on it thank you thank you very much